hello guys welcome to today's tutorial so following the last tutorial that we had where we made a motion graphic squeeze back today we are going to be now uh, doing a motion graphic squeeze back and a live uh, on a live video someone asked how do you do it on live shows so today I'm going to be using this live stream of me and with a motion video graphic uh, for this quiz back and then you're going to be doing it all together so that you can get an understanding of how it works so already as you can see i've already set up uh, my vmix uh, this right here is the video for the squeeze back this is the live feed you know hello yes i'm having a separate camera facing me from one angle and i'm working on a different angle uh, and then now we have this image right here now the image is what you're going to be using so that you can uh, have multiple um, images on this image so this is just more like a guiding video sorry a guiding image that you are going to be using uh, to merge uh, this image here with this other image here so without further ado let us now get cracking so what we're going to do we're going to come right here on that setting on that icon for the setup then we're going to come to multi view on multi view uh, for the first item you're going to select uh, the browser video and for the second item you're going to select the squeeze back sorry I think yeah, we're going to interchange the first item should be the squeeze back and the second item should be the browser video now we will come to the browser video and we play around with the zoom and the position we pan it uh, lift it up a little bit uh, then we zoom out until it fits to that uh, section that we made that black part that we made for it I think I have to zoom until you know when we feel contented that it has fitted on that space properly yeah. good now it has fitted very well so now this is going to be doing assuming now i'm you know uh discussing about a matter in the same same matter that i'm in the same same manner sorry that i'm doing it right now and i'm going to use the merge effect I click the merge effect and then now you can see that you know right right bottom over here uh, yeah subscribe to YouTube and then these are the side <laughs> it's quite confusing subscribe uh, like our Facebook page and then when the video is over we continue uh, it's that 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 simple so using the merge effect it has that uh, feel of animation to it so the only thing that we're going to be doing is just you know stay clear sorry stay clear so that when 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 you're done animating you fill up the space again you can also use now the cut function the cut is kind of pretty straightforward but you'll have now to initiate play on on the video for the squeeze back and uh, you also have the sorry the fade option yeah uh, I've got the fade option but 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 nonetheless for me the one that I always advocate for is the merge someone call it the squash because it combines the merge and the squeeze back but for me I just call it simply the squeeze back on the merge effect so that was all for today guys until next time uh, so that was all that we had for you guys today don't forget to subscribe to this channel like this video click on the notification icon right there so that you can be able to be notified when you upload new videos until next time guys have yourself a good one goodbye god bless